Hi guys, so today we are going to make a video about Quen 2.5 Coder 32B and we will compare it against uh, Cloud AI and GPT 4.0. So let's get started. So first I'm going to ask him to create the snake game in Python. Uh, I will first uh, enable variables. Um, okay, and I will ask him to create a snake game in Python. I will ask the same question to uh, GPT for O and Claude 3.5 Sonnet New. I'm almost quite sure that all the models will uh, do it right, but I want to test. Later, we will test with the Tetris game, and and I will try to find another game that will be interesting to test. So it's running on my 3090 and we will see what is the throughput of the model. Thanks. So it finished first. So it's a little bit faster, it seems, than GPT-40. We get... Uh, a hundred and forty, a uh, hundred and eighty tokens per second. Uh, I think the it's more ever rate. Okay, so we get twenty seven tokens per second, and right here uh, we don't know. Let's try the game and run it. No Python. Let's select another one. Pip install by game. Oh. Uh. Let's set the Python. Uh, yeah, just by env install three point eleven. We will wait until it installed. So this is the. Uh, Quen uh, uh, answer, so it's quite good. So yeah, I'm making this video because uh, Quen uh, Coder 3.32b just released. Uh, yeah, I think one or two hours ago. So there is no currently. There, currently, there is no um, a test that has already been already been done. So let's install Pygame and let's run it. So let's see. So it is working. We get a, a start where we need to. To press some keys to start it. It's strange because it seems that we can go up and then go down, which I don't think we can do normally. But it seems other than this, it seem it seems to be working. Let's try the ChatGPT one. 
let's run it. So the score is different. We get a comics uh, without MS. Like, and uh, <laughs> it's strange, <laughs> but the colors are the same. Let's try with the Claude one. Claude one had the best interface, but with Olama you can get the open, so open source interface and get the one you want. Okay, so it is working. It is using Pygame, but we get a grid, a strange grid. And the colors are different, but they are all working. And we get space to restart. I don't know which one is better for this task. Okay, so yeah, um, this model is uh, 90 gigabytes. So not so it's really really small compared to uh, Claude and ChatGPT one because I think they are like uh, 100 or 200 gigabytes. So yeah, it's cool. Uh, now let's ask him to create. I just cleared the context, and let's ask him to create a Tetris game in Python in python the tetris, the tetris game is a little bit harder than the um, than the snake game but let's try let's try anyway i'm not sure they will all uh, be able to do this because it's quite difficult so we can copy of this yeah so the clone one is seems faster due to the better hardware but i think if you have a 4090 for example it should be about the same speed and if you have two 4090 i think it, it will be faster on in local so let's try so this one is the um, the Quen one. So it's missing a color. I will just copy and paste one to make it work. Purple and it's hundred. Let's run it. Orange. Oh, so we get two colors that aren't good. Orange. And this time. A hundred right here. Okay, so we can move, we can force it to go faster, we can change the orientation so it is working. Let's try to make a row. I'm I'm generally impressed because it's really difficult for open source LLMs to do this task. And I think it's the first open source model that I saw being, being able to do it. Oh, and it's create, it's um, collapsing the rows. So now let's try to loss up. Oh, and we can go outside. Oh. <laughs> There is an issue, we can go outside. And we cannot lose. Okay, so a little bit working, but not quite good. The, it's missing some features like ending the game and not uh, not being able to move the blocks outside and also the score. Let's see how ChatGPT does. Let's save it. We got some errors, right? Yeah, right here. 
Let's try anyway. Yeah, it does not work. So as you can see, the Quen model, which is open source and way smaller than ChatGPT, managed to do better than ChatGPT. Isn't it awesome? So now let's try with the clothes on it, which is the best current available um, coding model that we can uh, use right now. Oh, and it failed. So, so, so the quantized version of Queen 32B is better than <laughs> Claude 3.5 sonnets that just released. Isn't it that crazy? <laughs> uh for me it's it's like huge it's incredible thanks a lot uh, queen 2 for making this model available let's try let's see if uh, they will be able to fix themselves so let's copy the error and give it and let's see if it will be able to correct itself So yeah, maybe on my PC now, I think I will always use now the Quen model. I will not go to chatgpt.com. I will just use, yeah, my 3090 in my PC to, to run LLM tasks. It's, it's, it's so amazing, man. Okay, let's see if it managed to correct itself. Okay. So it's now it's working. And we get a preview of the next uh, block with a score, which is which is neat. It it is neat. We can accelerate. We can can we go outside? Yeah, no, so we can't go outside. So it's the implementation is a little bit better than Queen 2, but Queen 2 managed to do it in the first try. The rows are disappearing. Okay. Let's see if we can die. Yeah, so we can die. So uh, I think Claude might be a little bit more, uh, a little bit better than Quen, but it's not a huge difference. It's really a small difference. And still, uh, Quen managed to do it in the first try and not Claude. So for me, it's like amazing. So thank you guys for watching this video. If you find it interesting and helpful, maybe you can leave a like. If you dislike the video, leave a dislike, I don't care. And um, maybe leave a comment because I want to, to know what you think about this video. Is it, is it useful? Did it help you? What can I improve? So yeah. If you want uh, me to try another model, for example, uh, feel free to ask. So have a nice day and bye-bye.